Welcome to another episode of Air Guns and Peasant Channel and today's review is on the Midwest Elite Air Guns magazine system right here for the FX Maverick chamber in 25 caliber. The factory magazines hold 16. This holds 30. There'll be other calibers available in 22 and 30 caliber. But this one, like I said, is in 25 caliber. There is a stop right here. Right there. Turn it kind of clockwise. Until it stops all the way around like that. You can drop a pellet down to hold it right there. And then when you're done, the lid is magnetic, shuts right down. Brilliant piece of engineering, if you ask me, you know, to be able to design something like this, you know, and 3D print out a magazine system. I'm already using his magazine, extended magazines for the Benjamin Marauder, the P Rod, Benjamin P Rod, and the FX Impact. All of them with extended magazines, and so far, I've been very happy with uh, Chris's magazines. My Midwest Elite Air Gun. He's an American company and a fellow avid air gunner like us all. Support his products, you know, because he's making uh, magazines for, starting to make magazines for other manufacturers, which is a good thing. So, yes, I will be testing this magazine out. I got my tactical cam and Gonna be shooting out to my 30 yard backstop to check the zero and the cycling of it. But let's do a short video on this real quick. This weekend, like I said, I'm going to a farming permission, a brand new one, and okay, this magazine right here will come in. 30 right rounds here. loaded, uh, 30 rounds of 25.39 uh, loaded in a magazine. I'm gonna sit you down for a second so I can go ahead and load this in the breech. Just like that. Side view. And the top view. side view so this magazine here the stock ones the factory ones will work good out in the woods if you're gonna lug this Maverick out in the woods but for shooters like myself bench rest shooters I shoot inside my pest mobile at the farm permission. So these magazines are a blessing to me because I spend less time loading, more time shooting. I also want to give a shout out to Tom over at High Pressure Pneumatics in Harrison, Michigan for selling me this uh, FX Maverick that you see. 
Got to show my support for him too, because uh, without him in my state of Michigan, I had to go to places like Pyramid or AOA or Utah, and nothing wrong with those places I just mentioned. It's just the fact that I want to support Michigan businesses. And Tom, just giving you a shout out there, buddy. All right. We're going to uh, check my zero and the FPS, all that good stuff. Nine ten. Nine forty eight. Nine twenty two. Thirty-three. All right. Nine fourteen. Nine oh four. Nine oh four. Okay, I'm getting there. And that's about where I want to be at speed wise don't really need this thing to be shooting that high anyways Zeroed in a little bit. Yeah, check out Tom at High Pressure Pneumatics. MyPressureAir.com. He's got a lot of uh, nice guns, accessories, scopes as well. Check out his website. Okay. There we go. Right where I want it to be. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay, that's it. Still got plenty of ammo left. I don't know how many shots that was, but that was more than enough for me. Zero this gun in. There you have it, folks. Another great product from Midwest Elite Air Gun. I also have uh, a magazine for the Crown. The Extended high capacity magazine I'll be testing next. So, folks out there, be on the lookout for that video, which will be coming out soon. Till then, shoot straight, stay safe, may your pellet hit its target, and we'll see you on the next episode of Air Guns and Testing Channel. See ya!